we're here to show you how to repair dings and dents your paddle may have received during the season. Here is a list of things that come with our kit. The 220 grit sandpaper, a very sharp razor, or putty stick, gloves, paper towel. And we also recommend having acetone or alcohol and the compressed air if possible. So the first thing you'll do is use the razor blade to remove any of the loose carbon or foam that may be flopping around. Then, with your 220 grit sandpaper, you'll sand the inside of the dent as well as 1 8 inch around the hole. Some people use tape to mask this area off. Next, you will then dust off any loose debris with compressed air and then follow up with a wiping with your paper towel and acetone or alcohol. Then, you take your putty stick and then you'll be cutting off about an eighth of an inch of the putty. You really don't need too much, but please make sure to remove the clear plastic film. Then with your gloves on, you're going to knead the putty until all the white is gone and you have a nice smooth black or gray putty. Break off a small amount of putty to shove into the dent. You don't want to be using too much, but just enough to make sure that the putty is flat. Wait 15 to 20 minutes and then your putty will be rock hard. Once it is, take it your razor blade and slice off any high spots. This is a lot faster than using sandpaper. Then you'll follow up with sandpaper if necessary um, and smooth out any of the areas. And just like that, you're ready to get back on the water. For more information about the putty stick, check us out on www.burnwater.com. Make sure to like us on Facebook and check us out on Instagram. Happy paddling.